Hi everyone, it's the English Summer here and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4. I almost said The Sims 3 again. This is The Sims 4 Part 3. So currently Emma is out here with Nina Caliente and I have no idea why this didn't click yesterday. I think I was just in a like crazy excitable mood that I wasn't really thinking. So sorry for the messy parts yesterday. But Nina Caliente came into The Sims in Sims 2 and she also continued into The Sims 3 in Barnacle Bay. So this is Nina Caliente and you know what? She's a cool sim. I like her as a sim. I find her and her sister hilarious. So we are going to get to know her a little bit more. We're going to tell a joke about Martians, you know? No, we don't want to hang out. Sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to click that. And we will we'll do an impression for her. Oh, that that Tom joke just ran are, away, but that's fine. Aga, aga. And also a bunch of you were like, "Oh my god, you can play games on your phone." So we are going to have Mr. Tom over here. Where is his phone? I think it's in his inventory. Okay. Um, no it's not actually. It's down here. I always forget. Tom, can you stop walking away from me please? I want you to play a game. So this will help us with our work because we have to play video games for four hours. So hopefully this counts as a video game and I think we'll do it a bunch of times. We'll play a game. We'll just get a couple of these up because you know we want him to get better and he's not gonna be okay so it does help with the video game skill which is good Tom can further develop his skills on computers tablets motion game rigs or even on his phone and this girl has left our house oh no Emma's angry what made her angry from Aggravating conversation. Feeling angry after an unpleasant conversation. Okay, so I'm guessing her chat with Nina didn't go so well. And she is stomping around in a terrible, terrible mood and also needs a toilet. She wants to try to calm herself down in the mirror. So Emma, that is what we are going to do. We're going to try to calm down, you know? I don't want my sims feeling angry. And I have the mouse currently, I have the Steel Series Sims 4 mouse and it is bright red at this very moment because she's angry. Oh, and so is he. You're just insulting her. <laughs> Nina's obviously very insulting. <laughs> you know what? Look at these two. <laughs> How mean is she? She's just like strutting away after she just insulted this poor kid. He wants to mock someone. Who's this? Brayden Ferguson. He looked like an easy target to mock. Oh, she's angry. May, you're gonna be our, uh, our... We're gonna unleash our anger on you because you're pretty angry too by the looks of it. She looks horrified that this little kid has just come up to her. Tyler is insane, so I could imagine him. Let's mock her outfit. And <laughs> he's being so mean. <laughs> Look at him. He's such a sassy little kid, but that helped. He mocked her. That's what he wanted to do. So yeah, he's pretty insane. So I could imagine him like being completely off his rocket and just insulting everyone he sees. These two are just having a conversation. Um, I want you to carry on with your games because you have not played it enough. So what do we want to do? Play a game and just do this. Emma, you're just talking to yourself now. <laughs> oh, she's funny. Okay, I'm going to stack up a bunch of these. There we go. And Tyler, what are you doing? Stop harassing people on the street, Tyler. You can't just be mean to people. Go and watch TV. Go and uh, watch some kids TV, you know. Maybe that'll make you happy. I doubt it, but oh well. We can try. Sorry, Tyler. Oh, she's sat down here having some garden salad. Which is always cute. I'm thinking maybe we should 
go out for the day because it's only um oh, actually it's 4 p.m but you know what we're gonna have tyler and emma we're going to travel with tyler and we are going to go to the park i think i kind of really want to show you like one certain interaction at the park it's the cutest interaction i've I love it in The Sims 4. I when I played it, I was just like, I love that interaction. So we are going to go to Magnolia Blossom, which is the park in the town. So let's head in, head on over here, and see who we can see at the parks. Come on, loading screen, you can do it. Here we go. Okay, so we are in Magnolia Blossom. Is anyone around? Oh, there we go. There's a friend for Tyler, Mr. Alexander, and Alexander Goth. Let's give him a little friendly introduction. You know, we want to be friends with at least one person. So come on over here, Tyler. He's going to run on over here and start talking to his new buddy, Alexander. Let's, um, come on. Let's talk about toys and enthuse about candy. Let's do that. Oh my goodness. I don't think my window's open, but the planes are really loud overhead. So give me a second, guys. I'm just going to go check really quickly. Okay, never mind. My uh, window was actually wide open. Are these two actually going to play chess, or did they just sit there to talk? We'll tell him a goofy story, and we'll discuss our interests. Oh, Emma's over here cheating in chess. <laughs> Did you just see that? I saw that. In the background, she completely flipped her things around whilst this chick wasn't looking. I think that's cheating, Emma. And you're not in a very friendly relationship with this May woman, considering your kid went crazy at her. Who are you? Hello? Who are you? Zayden. Zayden Westfall. Okay, he seems like... Tyler's just like, what are you wearing? <laughs> oh, come on, Alexander. I want to do an impression. No, dude, this is creepy. You don't just come to a park and start giggling in front of little kids. Let's suggest some fun activities because he's bored. He just completely came and downed our vibe. We are having quite a nice time. And Tom is going to um, care for himself. We'll just let him care for himself. Come on, dude. He's got an awkward comment. Why, oh why, did Tyler say that? <laughs> so he said an awkward comment. And Zayden, please leave. Alexander's happy, but he's, oh, he's now happy. Let's go play on here. You know, we're bored. Let's play pirate. Oh, look at all the kids. We have, who do we have here? Daryl Rockwell. And then we have, what's your name? What's your name? Maya Ferguson. And Kaylin. Kaylin Westfall. So we've got quite a few kids. And I want Emma to come over here and play as a sea monster. Oh. Tyler, are you, you going to go to the toilet, buddy? I think he really needs to go. He does. No, don't mock this poor boy. Look, look at this. <laughs> it's so funny. So she's pretending to be a sea monster for the kids. Which is adorable. I love this. Come on, Emma. Jump up. And the bubbles! I want a play area like this. I'm maybe 20 years old, but I would love a play area like this. <laughs> He's just mocking everyone that he sees. <laughs> right, Tyler, go to the toilet if you need it so bad. I've They're over here, I think. Yes, they are. Wow, these are nice toilets for a park. What? None of my parks have toilets like this. So go use the bathroom, and then I reckon we will head back home after he has done that. Emma, what are you up to? 
still... Oh no. She's just finished playing as the sea monster. So, Tyler, are you almost done? Oh, look at him. He really needs to go. Hurry, buddy. Don't wet yourself. <laughs> oh, there we go. He's on it. He's still a bit bored, though, I think. Yeah. He is most definitely bored. So, I think we're going to send both of them home. Emma is about to head home and Tyler can as well. Did he fill that up? He did. Which is good. So come on, let's skip through this and send them back on their way home. Let's switch control to one of these guys. Uh, switch control. So we'll head back home over to them because Tyler will be joining us at any moment, hopefully, if he actually listened to me. I hope he did. I do change around the um, house a little bit. I just changed um, this roof so it looks a little bit better. Someone did say it looks like a church and <laughs> I have to say I do agree it does look like a church for now but you know what we don't have much money. I added in the cheapest TV possible and I don't even really think they can see it from over this table but it's all good. Tyler come home. There we go. Okay. Oh, um, guys, I don't think you should just be sat there chatting on your son's bed. Um, Tyler, what do you need, buddy? He's made a friend. Oh, is Alexander our friend? Oh no, they're acquaintances. He does not like me. <laughs> yeah, watch some TV, dude. It's 8 o'clock, so you're going to be heading to bed soon. And Tom, hmm. you still need to play video games. So let's play some games. Hopefully we get that option in work, because that will help us in that. And Tyler, what do you need, buddy? He needs two skills to level four and to attend school whilst energized. Okay, so he's feeling quite playful right now, but it is 9pm, so I've got a feeling that we should be sending- oh, Emma's already getting into bed. I was gonna say, we should be sending our sims to bed soon, I think. So, Tom, can you get up and uh, stop playing games in your son's bedroom? Tyler, please don't sleep in that bed. Go and sleep in your own. And Tom, what time do you have work, mister? She's just giggling in her sleep. What is she dreaming about? Um, we don't have work. We only have work on Tuesdays. So that means that we can carry on playing games. Because we don't have to be up tomorrow, thankfully. So let's just play some games whilst these two are asleep. I want to actually figure out what she's dreaming about because she's just giggling away over her. But see? What is, what is she dreaming about? Well anyway, I'm going to skip the night and I'll get back to you guys in the morning once all the sims have woken up. So it's now morning and Emma has just woken up and she is desperate for the toilet so we're gonna have her go to the toilet and uh, yeah she needs to relieve herself should we say and then I think we'll wake Tyler up and he can have a quick meal of some cereal before he goes to school because I'm fairly sure he will have school as it is a Monday he's embarrassed he's still embarrassed bless him I don't know what he's embarrassed by or what comment even made him embarrassed but he is most definitely embarrassed. So go on Tyler, you go and eat your cereal. And Emma, can you serve some scrambled eggs? That was 10 simoleons, that was pretty steep. But you know, we're gonna get her into a job as well, I think. So she is acquiring the cooking skill. Emma's new skill in cooking will allow her to protect to prepare delicious straightforward classics. Did she just drop some- oh yeah she's not very good yet. <laughs> oh yeah she dropped the pepper in. 
Oh, Emma. Oh, I just saw a little sneaky Mortimer goth walk past. Are you still eating your breakfast? Okay. What time do you actually have? You have school at 8 a.m. Which I'm guessing you leave an hour early, if I can remember rightly. So go use the bathroom. And I kind of want to get a shower instead of a bath. So I'm going to quickly go over to buy mode and see if we can sell a bath for money. And uh, see if we can get a shower instead because that will help him to become energized. And look at this guys, we have a search bar. So you can just search for showers and all the showers come up. How much do we get if we sell this? 200 smolians. And how much is a shower? Oh, um, no. We're going to keep it for now. You know what? Can't afford it. These are the sacrifices we have to make. Come on, Emma. <laughs> You're not very good at this, are you? Come on. Oh, she burnt it. My goodness. Yeah, that's doesn't seem that great. It's only an okay, okay quality. So we're going to put that in the fridge. If we open that, you can see that we have our scrambled eggs and our garden salad. So Tyler, to get energized, are you having a nap? No, you're hiding from everyone because you're embarrassed. I want you to have a nap so that you feel energized. So definitely do that. Hopefully, we won't need to sleep the full amount because... Oh, we should have done his homework, actually. Oh, well. We'll do it tonight. <laughs> Who has homework before they even start school? That doesn't make sense. But yeah, we'll leave him to sleep until he has to go. Oh, look at these two. Emma, what are you doing? Why, why aren't you eating? Or have you finished? Clean that up, please. Just go clean it up. Go on. Get rid of that. Oh, she's still eating. I'm so confused. Oh well. Inspiration comes to creative sims often, but if creative activities are, are ignored, their moods will suffer. We're going to clean this up. Come on, girl. Go clean it. Just... You, 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 did you just take his cereal from him when he wasn't even finished? I am so confused. But she's gonna go... Oh, we need to get you up. You're missing school. Go to school. Whoops, that was my fault. I love how they have to scrape it off into the bin before they clean up. But yeah, Tyler, you should definitely be in school. And we probably should have got him to not be embarrassed. Because who wants to go to their first day of school embarrassed? I've got a feeling school's going to be hard enough for him. And can we... Um, no. We'll just work normally. He's only a C grade student at the minute, which is kind of bad. But he's not had much time to do stuff, so there's no blaming him for that. Tom, we definitely don't have work today. So I want you to... Let's check out your needs. Take a shower. Stop swooning over each other, you two. They can't keep their hands off each other, can they? <laughs> so go have a shower, buddy, or a bath. And then I think we will go to the library. And hopefully they'll have computers there where we can play some computer games. So we will travel. And... Emma, how are you feeling? She's feeling fine. I think we should watch... What should we watch? Watch the cooking channel. She's creative, so she is fairly good at cooking and painting and instruments. But we don't have enough money for an instrument right now, so that's kind of sucky. But we will get there, I promise you, hopefully. Come on, dude. This is why I don't like having baths. They take forever in The Sims. And he's feeling happy. Which is always good. Emma, why don't you invite someone over? I think that would be fun. 
yeah, you agree with me? She she agreed with me on that one. She was like, uh-huh. So we should hmm, invite to hang out at current lot. I kind of want to invite Nina over. Let's see if she's free. I can imagine us being friends with Nina, even though our son hates her. Low quality bath. Not every bath leaves a sim feeling squeaky clean. And Nina will be over right away. But we're gonna... Oops, I forgot about that. But we're gonna head over to the library and see if they have a computer over here. Hopefully Nina will still continue to come and they can just kind of take care of themselves and things like that. Whilst we try and get our gaming up, hopefully there will be a PC in here. This is one thing I love about The Sims 4 is that everything is all in one place. Like, no, I mean that there's so many Sims in one place. There's Caliente. We found another one. Katrina, how you doing? She's a really pretty Sim. Right, let's go on this computer and let's play some Sims Forever. Yes. Let's play some of that. Come on, buddy, before someone else gets the computer. There we go. We're on it. Look, he's playing The Sims. Looks like The Sims 1 to me. <laughs> I love this feature. Oh, uh, it just, I love it. It's so good. Why don't you socialize with Nina? You can definitely do that. Look! The Love Heart Hot Tub! Yes! That used to be one of my favourite things when I was younger. That sounds really creepy. Like, I was like, probably like, I don't even know, 8 or 9 when I first started playing Sims? When my older brother first introduced it to me and Sims 1. Such a throwback, but such a good game. So good. There's a lot of Sims here and everyone's chatting to each other. I like it. Let's check out who else we have. Diana Tan, I think was her name. She's currently speaking about aliens. Or playing a game about aliens. Something along those lines. Who else have we got? We've got like a kids room with an art set. So it'd be fun to bring Tyler here too. And then upstairs we just have more bookshelves and places to read. Let's have a look at this from the outside. All the Calientes have such a swagger in their walks. But yeah, this is cute. I like this library. Mhm. Mm I am a fan. That's the gym. That's, oh yeah, that's still the gym. This is the nightclub. So Tom has reached video gaming level two, which is good. These are socializing and he's working normally. Um, uh, to do, 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 yeah, you can just carry on socializing. How are you doing, Tom? How many hours have you been playing video games now? He has been playing for three out of four hours, so a little bit longer, and he should be good to go. And we'll hopefully move this on up. And his ideal mood is to be focused. Okay, so we use the video games for four hours and the daily task is to use a computer. It's going to be quite hard considering we don't have a computer at home because we cannot afford it. Whoa! Check out this dude going for his workout. Kellen Browning. He, he just whipped those muscles out. But yeah, we're going to have him just carry on using the computer. He's almost done. Who are you? Mika. This is so cool. I love having lots that are full. I miss this about The Sims 3. Like, whenever you tended to go to a lot, it was kind of... I don't know, there wasn't that many Sims around, but in The Sims 4, there seems to be a lot. Let's have a look at what's going out on the street. We've got Jim having a run. What else? Not much. 
some cars driving by. Obviously, cars aren't playable. A lot of people have asked about that in the past and like have asked me on my videos. Will Sims 4 have cars? Not as of yet. They have them for decoration. However, they aren't playable as of yet. But who knows? They could be easily added into the game, I think. So maybe we will have them at some point. I hope we do because I think they are a good thing to have. Okay, so we've come finished our daily task oh he's his sims are having a fire so I think we are going to go home and go see if Nina's there hopefully she will be but I'm not too sure she might not have come because I was away from the lot so come on buddy let's go home oh can we follow him oh no <laughs> He was just running to the end of the block so that he could go home. So the loading screens I really don't think are that bad. They're not even 10 seconds. I was quite worried with Let's Plays because obviously you have to try and talk over them and they s like I was worried they were going to break up the things a bit but they don't at all. They're really not that long. So Nina is still here. Emma how are you doing? You need hygiene. Why don't you take a bath? Um, you're feeling uncomfortable. Yeah, go give her a funny introduction, you know? You can get to know her a little bit. Will share brilliant ideas. She seems to uh, like our brilliant ideas. Let's um, ask her about her day. And... No, not mean. Do an impression. Maybe tell a funny story. If she likes us, that is. She does. So we're going to do an impression. And he just acquired the comedy skill. <laughs> I think... I said I was going to do another Sims 4 Let's Play of a single Sim. I'm not going to start it for like a week or so maybe because I just want to focus on this family as of now. But I think we'll have her be a comedian. I think that'll be fun to do. Let's give her a heartfelt compliment. Because we are in a happy mood, we can share our happiness and we'll brighten her day. And then we'll tell her an outrageous story. Why not? She seems to like us. She might not like our kid, but she seems to like the parents, which is always good. Emma, how you doing? You almost finished in that bath. Because this is going to take forever. I kind of just want Tom to go to work and get his skill uh, paid, because we have barely have any money. I don't like not having money in this game. Tom, why don't we reveal brilliant invention? We've not invented anything, but he's gonna... Oh, yeah, we have. Oh, did she just take that off us? Um, I don't know what that just did. Hopefully she won't use that against us. Let's joke about politicians. Emma's just gonna sit down and have a read. She's had enough of Nina. What's up with you, buddy? You need some hunger. We can do that. So go and open this. Grab some green salad. And then I think we'll do our homework. So come in. Grab something to eat. You know, he's had a hard day at school. Look at his little face. He looks worn out, bless him. He looks so bored. <laughs> oh, poor Tyler. But we'll have him do his homework. I, how can Emma be so... She must have a very good relationship with her husband because Nina Caliente is a very pretty sim, yet she does not seem bothered whatsoever. He's playful because he's on a roll with his joke. We are not going to make a flirtatious joke. No, sorry. We are not going to do that. Let's flash our crazy eyes. <laughs> we just look like our son then. She's crying with laughter. You know, he's good at making friends. He's all out there and self-confident. Whilst Emma's just, like, 
Give me a drink of orange juice. I'll go sit with my son. <laughs> Is this spoiled? No. That's good. What are you doing? You gonna go join in the conversation? Tyler, have you finished? Oh, yeah, he has. So he is gonna do his homework. Let's see how he does with his homework. It looks like maths to me. It looks like a pie chart. Doing homework is an important step towards getting good grades. If you guys hadn't noticed in this part, I have turned off the tutorial. Sorry about that if you did want to see it, but I didn't really pay attention to it and I felt like it was just distracting me whilst I was playing and wasn't as natural as a normal let's play would be. So I turned it off. If you guys want to know how to do that, I will leave a link in the description below. Sims VIP did a step through of how you turn that off if you want to. If you want to keep it on, go for it. It does teach you a lot about the game. But I just felt like it took away from my let's play a bit. So definitely check that out if you want to get rid of that. Look at these guys. They're just having a nice casual conversation. I like it. <laughs> but I think we're going to end this part here. You know, we're, Nina's finally warming up to us. She's still an acquaintance, I think. Um... Yeah, she's still our acquaintance, but she's happy and D uh, Tyler, I almost called him Dylan for some reason, Tyler's over here doing his homework. He had a good day for first day of school, I think, hopefully. He was feeling a little bit uncomfortable, but you know what? That's what happens when you're a kid and you go to your first day of school. But thanks for watching, guys. Give this part a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. I'm sorry that I am talking a lot and kind of just getting a feel for the game but the parts will get more structured hopefully <laughs> fingers crossed the parts will become more structured once i get into it and things like that i'm just so excited right now i just want to do all these things with it so thank you all for watching and i will speak to you all in the next part bye guys <laughs>